Uh, Jody Turner, registered natural nutritionist, is with me. Good morning and good morning. happy new year to you. Happy new year to you too. And uh, you know we can make it a healthy new year too, and still be we happy. We are going to make it a healthy and happy new year. I like that. Yes. Now the words uh, that I often hear is egg McMuffin. You've taken the mick out. I've taken the mick out. That's okay. right. And we've had so the healthiest. Egg muffins. Egg muffins. This is a good way to start your day. This is one of those things where I, you know, I know that a healthy breakfast is important. Uh, but I'm so hungry in the morning that I, I jam whatever I can get my hands on. <laughs> There's a way to get your hands on these really fast, easily. Fast, fast, exactly, okay. very quick. So I mean, like, the nice thing about these egg muffins is that we can make them ahead of time. Okay. You know, you can make a big batch on a Sunday afternoon, for example, freeze them or put them in the fridge. They'll stay good for up to a week in the fridge. Just wow. wrap them up, you know, and then we can warm them up in the microwave or warm them up in the toaster oven as you need them in the morning. So just pop them out. You know, you need six in the morning and, you know, to feed everybody and... Done and done. Done and done. Is this easy nice, enough quick, that even easy a guy like me could do it? Definitely. Okay. Definitely. Because the you... thing is, too, is that we could use leftover vegetables from dinner the night before. I like that if idea. If you've got a, you know, if you're making a stir fry for dinner, how about make a little bit extra and then you've got those cooked vegetables and then you can just throw them in. Brilliant. That's actually We're using actually nice brilliant. raw vegetables this morning because mm -hmm. they're that much more nutritious the less cooked that they are. I'm a huge pepper you know? fan, so, so I love So lots the, of peppers, the lots of colors. That's mm -hmm. what we want. These are... These are, are healthy carbohydrates. You know, okay. like we need to remember that our carbohydrates are the body's preferred fuel source. Right. Nice, simple, clean burning energy. I'm and lots do this. and lots of colors. Yeah. Do so I beat them up? Beat up the eggs. That's okay. right. Yeah. So about a dozen to maybe 15 eggs to make about 12. Uh, okay. 12 uh, muffin cups or so. Perfect. And then, yeah, and then we'll throw in maybe a little bit of curry. Okay. A nice anti-inflammatory spice. Curry is beautiful mm. in eggs, thanks to Mr. Bob Butcher, who did that since we were a little kid. Okay. Making us curried eggs on Sunday afternoons. Was that, what was that second? It's got a little ingredient? bit of cumin as okay. well, too. Of course, you can add a little pepper as well, too, stuff like that. You know, there's no need to add uh, add salt because we've got lots of flavor already. Eggs have great flavor, and you can add in Yeah, we're going to use the whole here. egg as well, too, because, oh, I mean. Yolks and all. Yolks and all like I mean the egg white is a beautiful source of protein mm -hmm. but I mean like the B12 the choline the inositol all these B healthy B vitamins for energy Absolutely. and help combat stress okay the iron you know the uh, the vitamin D you know like all the goodness that's in the nutrient of the yolk Perfect. so once you've got all that beat up then we've okay. got our muffin tin prep so we can spray this with a little uh, you know like uh, with a, a you know a cooking spray or something Perfect. like that or just non-stick pan that kind of thing mm -hmm. and then we'll just start throwing in our veggies you know like so and Think colors, 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 because all the different colors uh, represent different antioxidants. And you want to attract your family to it, right? Colors right. look Col delicious. Colors look delicious, and the antioxidants in food, like the nutrients in these food, the antioxidant provides the color to the food. Excellent. So if you're leading a lot of different colors of foods, mm -hmm. then you're getting a lot of different nutrients, a lot of different antioxidants, you know? And, and this so looks like you're balancing, you're balancing a lot of material with the egg to give you more. Exactly. You know, we're going to balance the protein and the healthy fat that's in this egg with the healthy carbohydrates. So this is a complete meal because we've got a carbohydrate of protein and some healthy fat coming from like the protein and the healthy fat coming from the egg and it. the beautiful carbohydrates coming from our veggies. What do you got there? What are you putting in there? Lots of spinach. Oh, you know, I love this spinach. is great because it's a good way for us to get vegetables in the morning. You know, like we should be trying to get five to eight servings that's of fruits and veggies. That's interesting because that's something where you skip usually. Veggies in the morning. Yeah, a smoothie is another really great way to get uh, veggies in the morning, you know, but we're just, you know, um, yeah, so sorry, you can't you know, reach these things, but we're just going to start throwing in all sorts no, of No, go for it. I'm going to let you do it. You're a pro. I like that. A nice little Some button asparagus. mushroom. Asparagus. Asparagus is an interesting asparagus. choice because it goes Why really not? well with eggs. Really well with eggs, you know. Nice. And mushrooms for that matter, too, you know. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, so lots of different colors. You know, some onions as well, too, for antimicrobial properties. You know, things like onions and garlic and oregano kill oh, bugs. Yes. Right. Keep, You're right. Keep the flu bug Could away. use one now. Yeah, so all right, beat so that all up. This is and then what I'm we just simply pour this in. How much do you want to put in there? Oh, you know what we didn't do is we didn't. Uh, we could also add some cheese if you want. Could to. you? If you, want if you wanted to add some cheese, more protein. You could add some ham. You could add some crumbled turkey sausage. Okay. Something like that, you know. But we wanted to fill the muffin cup up about three quarters of the way. Okay. You know. So yeah. So I mean, you we, just we, leave yourself enough because the egg will pop yeah, up and rise. Yeah, it'll pop up. Right? Yeah, exactly. And then so there's some nice crumbled goat cheese in there. Oh, you know, right we don't have to go dairy. Nice? Right. You know, we can put the goat cheese in there for more protein as well too. This is sounding also, unbelievable. Also, for fussier eaters, mm -hmm. you know, always adding the cheese. Helps, it you does know. help. And it, a little goes a long way as well, I know well people too. who don't like spinach, which, uh, you know, is fine. I get that you don't like it. But once it's cooked, I, I almost feel like you can't, it really mellows and it's, 
out yeah. of the way. Yeah, so yeah. you're getting it in because spinach is so good for you. It's very good for and you. It's rich in iron, B vitamins. You aren't even noticing. For energy, yeah. combat stress, all these different colors for like vitamin A and vitamin C. You know, there's, there's more vitamin C in a red pepper than there is in an orange. I did know that, but only recently <laughs> when my wife said, you know, there's more vitamin C in a red pepper than an orange. So and vitamin C, I mean, our, our bodies need that, like it. our immune system boosts the immune system. Uh, and this so time of year, you need that. Muffins. So boom, you put it in the oven for how put long? Put it in the oven. Be really quick. About 25 minutes. Oh wow! So you and can even make this out. while you're doing dinner. Get the leftover veg, well, cook exactly. it the night before, yeah, throw it in the fridge. The kids to do look it. at those. Those get look the amazing. Get the kids to make their own. You know what I mean? Like that way, they, it's like dressing a pizza. Dude. They can make their own things. You know, like do your own thing in it. Yeah. Um, you like asparagus and mushrooms? Then fill it full of asparagus and mushrooms. You like ham and cheese? Then use ham and cheese. Is I would take hot, a bite, hot, but it hot? might be lava time here. All right, you're coming back, and what are we going to discuss next? We're going to make energy balls next. So a really great pre-workout, workout, workout post-workout snack. You know, another mm -hmm. really good source of carbohydrates. Again, lots of fiber. So sorry, sorry. Oh, no There's worries. some cold ones over there, but good. no one likes cold eggs. Yeah, you got it. Coming up in just a moment, back with more on CTV Morning Live, helping you live better in 2013. Fantastic. Mm, yep. <laughs>